I drove my Mercury to see my friend on Venus. How on earth will I ever get to Mars? Jumping Jupiter, Saturn's party, Saturday, Uranus, and Neptune will drive in Pluto's car. Hi there, my name's Kirsten. I work at the Edgerton Public Library, and I'm so glad you're logged in to watch this episode of our library shorts. Can you tell by my song what our theme is this month? That's right. The theme of all of our library shorts this month touches on the solar system in space. And we're also partnering with the Children's Museum of Rock County to share some packets and other fun activities throughout Rock County. So I hope you'll check out those activities and stop by any of the seven Arrowhead Library System libraries to pick up a packet and explore more fun about our solar system. So today I want to show you a fun activity that you can try at home, uh, kind of an experiment that only works because of a really cool force that exists in our solar system, and that force is gravity. Okay? Now we can think of forces as either a push or a pull, and gravity is a force that's exerted by objects with mass, like this orange, and with another object, like our planet Earth. So if I drop this orange, what do you think is going to happen? That's right. It's going to accelerate or speed up as it falls to the ground. Okay, And that's because of the force of gravity. Now, all the planets in our solar system, the ones I named in the song, all have a different force of gravity acting um, between that planet. So today I want to show you an activity that will only work here on planet Earth. And I have a friend that's here today that's going to help me. Would you like a dollar? I would love a dollar. Okay, you can keep this dollar if you can catch it, okay? So I took a dollar bill and I folded it like this. And I want you to put your hands on like this. And if you can catch this dollar, you can keep it. You want to try again? Yes. Now, I have to tell you, I feel confident in doing this experiment because I know a little bit about gravity and science. Humans have a reaction time that is not fast enough to be able to catch this dollar in this distance because of the rate that this dollar is going to be accelerating or speeding up due to the force of gravity. So knowing how fast something is going to be speeding up. I know that my friend's reaction time, even though it's probably pretty fast, isn't enough to catch this dollar. So that's a fun trick that you can try at home. Maybe you can uh, offer to give somebody your dollar if they can catch it and they won't be able to. Okay. Now, if I were able to travel to another planet, say Jupiter, um, the acceleration due to gravity is about two and a half times what it is here on Earth. So I really wouldn't be able to catch the dollar there. Before we uh, leave today, I wanna sing that song with you again. And I also wanna remind you that your local library is a great place to pick up books about so many subjects, including space. So I shared this book with you, Space is Awesome. Here's another fun one, True or False, The Solar System. And then we have books about all the planets in our solar system. So you can request those books through, uh, through our share catalog. Uh, and no matter which library has them, they'll be delivered to your home library and you can check them out. Okay, we're going to sing that song again. I hope you'll join me. This names the planets in order of their distance from our sun. Okay. Get your cars ready. I drove my Mercury to see my friend on Venus. How on earth will I ever get to Mars? Jumping Jupiter, Saturn's party, Saturday, Uranus, and Neptune will drive in Pluto's car. Thanks for joining me with this library short. Bye-bye.